so this tutorial is about this line, this horizontal line for strings with gate curves. Mm -hmm. So particularly when you have an horizontal line that is around the border between the rows of pixels that are controlled by two curves. What I mean is this. Look at this curve here. Controls with pixels of about this width, this way, and then this one, the first one here, controls pixels this way. You understand? So now you have a line around the border. I'm not sure if this line originates from this, if it's this curve, that is the faulty curve, or if this one is it, it's this one. You understand? So we're not talking about, there's no house screen issue here. We only didn't connect this side. So, now, how do you determine which cuff, you know, is responsible for this line? So let me show you. Uh, there's a signal you can disconnect. I can help you determine that. So, and the signal, I'm going to disconnect it right on this cuff for this to make more sense. I'll disconnect it from the second curve. Uh, notice that there are four curves on this panel, on one side. On each side, the left or right, of course. But there are no curves on those side, on that side, because uh, you know we had issues with that side and had to detach the curve. Okay, so this is the second curve. First one is this way. So I'm going to do this to the curve. So specifically, the signal, it is the clock signal that I'll disconnect. So I'll disconnect in such a way that I can restore it. So this is what I would do. So as I work on it, watch the line. Notice uh, we have uh, what looks like uh, lines, uh, scanning lines, something like that. Let me press play on the remote. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. Mm -hmm. So now we see. Oh, I forgot. We didn't uh, mark the line. I suppose this is it. First thing should have been marking the line yeah but this looks like problem is from this from the first cup here mm. let's see this so it looks like problem is from the first cup here because i can see that this being the first Mm. Yeah, this being the first or the last row of pixels controlled by this, so we have it missing here. Yeah, so I can see that this one. Let me zoom in. Mm. Ah, so here is the original line. Let me mark it again here. This one. Here. Yeah. That's the original line. And now we have scanning lines beginning from here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Controlled by you know, the pixel on this the second pixel. So that would indicate that the problem. This line is from this cuff. It's controlled by this cuff. So I'll, I'll replace this cuff. And then we'll restore this. Before we restore this, excuse me, we'll restore the signal that was caught here. Before we restore it, uh, we'll see how it shows first. You understand? So uh, that's about it.
So that's the cuff now. It's just been replaced. This is the second one, the one that I disconnected the signal of. Uh -huh. That's the one that I replaced. Now let's power on and see if we still have that line. Uh, here's the point where we marked, that's where the line was. Mm. And here too. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. So there you see, the line is gone. So all we have left are the scanning lines from the line that I disconnected, the signal that I disconnected, a CPV signal, the first CPV signal. So let me reconnect the signal or restore it and then we'll see what happens. Oh, you're still. Uh -huh. <laughs> So that's how to fix lines that are around the border between columns or columns of pixels or, or columns of pixels controlled by two curves or rows of pixels controlled by two curves.